The Texas horned lizard is a creature of contrast. Fierce in appearance, yet harmless to all but insects. The species may be threatened today, but in legend and lore, it has always been a survivor. Everyone is familiar with Tale of Old Rip. He's our most famous citizen. Uh, he's dead, but he's our most famous citizen still. Near Abilene, the town of Eastland is home to the best known horned lizard of all time. Old Rip. In 1897, they were getting ready to lay the cornerstone for a brand new courthouse. People were getting together, putting things in the cornerstone, newspapers, Bible, coins, different things. And Ernest Wood, he noticed his son playing with a horn toad. And he said, son, motion to him, bring that horn from. They sealed it up. Nobody thought much about it. Flash forward 31 years. I call it 31 years of peace and quiet. It's 1928. Eastland has boomed and plans a newer courthouse. By demolition day, the local newspaper speculates about the courthouse cornerstone's horned inhabitant. Every day, something about, is this horn toad going to be alive? So uh, had a good sized number of people here. Went in there and opened it up. Didn't look to be alive at all. And uh, while the man was holding it up, the other leg twitched, and somebody said, he's alive. The story of a horned lizard hibernating for 31 years captured more headlines. Well, they named him Rip, like Rip Van Winkle. Old Rip met the president and toured the country. His story inspired much debate and even a cartoon or two. It definitely was a Warner Brothers cartoon. And of course, the story was a little bit different. They had him actually performing in the circus and things like that. Hello, my baby. Hello, my honey. Hello, my raccoon gal. I don't believe we got any credit on that at all. Baby, my heart's on fire. Old Rip wasn't a singing, dancing frog, but he was a celebrity. When he passed away, he was laid to rest in a tiny casket at the courthouse. And here he is, the world famous Old Rip. Yeah. It's amazing. Uh, we've had people from everywhere wanting to see Old Rip. There's the horn frog. Wow. Just there. He sleeps all the time. 80 years later, visitors still stop to pay their respects. And locals still swear by the story. It's absolute biblical truth. Incredible, but true. The Old Rip tale may sound far fetched to a biologist. But it's a great legend which helped promote the Texas horn lizard.